All right, and we're back. Today's video is about my flags, especially with Memorial Day coming. I was looking at them when I did the um, flag for my friend's uh, 2022 Street Glide the other day. And when I unwrapped them, because I only run them so many times a year, when I unwrapped them, I started checking them over. And this one, as you can tell, if you had the Harley flags, this has already been replaced. You can see it's stitched three times all the way around. It's really heavy material. This one's really well made by Kuriakin. When I took a look at my POW flag, this is the one that came with the Harley uh, flagpole, the one that hooks on the saddlebags or on the trunk. This is what I found again. So this is what happened to the American flag. This crap dry rocks. I don't know what the hell they make it out of, but it's made out of some cheap, cheap material. So what I ended up doing was buying, and some of you may not know that you can replace the flags on these. And how it's done, as you see at the top here, okay, you have this little plastic uh, retainer ring that snaps on, and all you have to do is get into it with a screwdriver. Let's see if I can do this without losing it. Had a heck of a job doing the American flag. You got it. You got it. What happens is it, it locks into a uh, groove inside the top of the flag post. So let's see if I can get this real quick. Got to get up underneath it without snapping it. And you don't want it flying across the room, obviously. So. Come on. And there it goes across the room. But I seen where it went. When I did the American flag, I did it outside. Boy, it went sailing. So what I ended up picking up, this is much smaller. And I may end up swapping the American one out to a smaller one too. Because I, I, what I've been doing lately uh, when I run them is I've been running them on the tour pack instead of on the saddlebags. So technically the flags don't have to be quite as large. So what this is, is a six by nine. So yes, it's definitely much smaller, but this is made by a veteran owned company. Supposedly it will hold up the highway speeds without a problem, double stitched. Uh, material is, is a nylon, but it's nylon all the way through, not uh, what Harley had on this flag that actually holds it, this material here. I don't know what the heck this is, but this crap just dry rots and falls apart after a couple years. It's like you spend $40 a piece for these things. That's what you end up with. So we're going to see. Hopefully this will work for this. It may not, but I'm going to try it. It was cheap enough. And like I said, it's supporting a veteran-owned company. So, far as I'm concerned, that's worth the money anyway. So, there we go. And there it is on there. So, that's it. So, and like I said, the nylon is all the way through. And not, like, I don't know what that material is, but they, it, it, my American flag did the exact same thing, came completely apart. So, then all you have to do is pop this back on. Okay, basically what you're going to do is push down on it. And you just have to spread it open like you did to take it off. Get it on here. Come on. There we go. That's all there is to it. And there it is. So now it's on there. And like I said, I'll have the, you know, the P I like to fly the POW flag with it. So now this Kuriakin flag, they used to make the POW and evidently they stopped making it. So, and yes, it's much smaller, I realize that, but like I said, the Kuriakin flag, this material, this thing, I've been running this for probably four years now, and it hasn't, uh, no dry rot, no nothing up in here. It's really, really well made, and I wish they still made the POW flag, but they don't. I looked all over the place, but this will work, and like I said, um... I may pull the American flag off of that one and get the American flag in this size for it. 
and then because on top of the tour pack they obviously they sit up much higher on the tour pack mounted up you know when you're when you're driving they're you know they're up here like this when they're down on the saddle bag i you know i prefer um a bigger flag you know larger flag for it so all right well in any case with that said i'll post a link to this guy's ebay page uh so if you need replacement flags you know i think it was 12.99 ship so worth it all day long and guaranteed and again the material is it's a heavier nylon than the um the harley brand one too so hopefully this will hold up which i'm sure it will because like i said it's not that cloth material here that'll dry rot so all right i'll see you guys in the next video please don't forget to hit like and subscribe see you later